God bless you. Right. Now, anyway, oh my God, that's a piece that. But leave it on. No, are you crazy looking down with these cams? That's a piece that I did on uh, Saturday Night Live, and I did a lot of insane pieces on Saturday Night Live. And uh, the, the thing about characters that you end up developing in Saturday Night Live, the most interesting ones are the least ones you think will work. I remember uh, there was a makeup artist at Saturday Night Live. Her name was Marion Sieber. And she was the most defensive human being on the face of the earth. She was... She always chained someone. You could smoke back then in the 80s, you know, in the room. And she would always... Like, you'd sit in the chair and say, gee, look, Mary, I look a little pale. She'd say, I know that. You don't think I know that? I'm a makeup artist. I would know that. <laughs> Sorry, Mary. So, Billy Crystal and I were writing this Make piece of satire of, uh, yeah. of uh, 60 Minutes, and we needed to, a defensive lawyer. I was going to play a defensive lawyer. I didn't know who to play. And he said, why don't you play Marion Siebert? <laughs> <laughs> he said, you know, you do her all around behind her back in the office. <laughs> why don't you just... Do her. I said, well, sh she'll find out. He said, oh, she'll never find out. They never find out, you know? And you're a guy, she's a girl. She's like, she's not going to find out. So then I, I, I said, okay, and I committed to it, and I had the glass, I had the cigarette thing, you know? But I forgot that when we shot the piece, Marion would be there because she was the makeup artist. And so it's, it was surreal. I'm sitting behind a desk. Harry Shearer's playing Mike Wallace, he's cross-examining me, and here's Miriam, and I'm saying, I know that, you don't think I know that? I'm a lawyer, I would know that. They say, cut, he's sweating, Miriam would say, I know that, you don't think I know that? I'm a <laughs> it was insane. So, then the character was a big hit, and every time a character is a big hit in Saturday Night Live, uh, you end up repeating it, and you repeat it and repeat it, and every time I did it, I was terrified that she was going to find out, and she never found out. And then, but the last show, there was a big party, and her assistant got drunk, and he walks in and says, Marion, how stupid are you? Don't you know your needs and serve? Everyone knows it but you. And she was devastated. She came up and she confronted me and she said, I thought you were my friend. I said, Marion, I am your friend, but don't you know that impersonation is the highest form of compliment? And she said, I know that. You don't think I know that? <laughs> Anyway, I did a lot of uh, characters, a lot of movies after that, and, uh, and, but I think that my favorite movie that I ever made was when I was asked to re-team with Steve Martin, playing a Wadden Quadnetter in the film Father of the Bride. Uh